guys, it's me Sammy. So today I'm going to be showing you a video on a haul and this was quite huge. So yeah, let's just get started. Um, so I actually failed filming this video the first time, but you know what, what the heck. So first thing I'm going to show you is Forever 21 and I was so excited to go Forever 21 because um, I wanted to get a pencil case from Victoria's Secret because I don't like having the basic pencil cases that everyone else has. I don't know, it's just me. Um, and <laughs> so I went to Forever 21 and I um, went to look for pencil cases because my friend said that they got some there and they were super cheap. So um, before finding the pencil cases that I wanted, I found these exfoliating gloves. And um, I'm Ratchet, so I'm also going to use these for when I want to... Um, exfoliate but also when I'm using my curling wand and I don't want to burn myself because I'm not exactly acclimated to it yet I'm still a newbie to it so <laughs> yeah hopefully these really help me these were a dollar okay so I got two pencil cases one for like my basic needs like I'm sorry I have the hiccups sorry one for my basic needs like pencils highlighters and pens and stuff like that um and then one for like colored pencils, markers, stuff that I don't use on the everyday basis, and then, like, some beauty essentials. So this one is going to be for, like, um, my not everyday things, if that makes sense. And this one was 580 I love this one because it's just polka dot and then it has leather. It's, like, that's, like, my vogue. Okay. And then I got this one that says love. Oh, this is absolutely adorable. Like, light pink plus sunflowers is, like, yes, I love it. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This is four eighty, and then um, I have they put this in here. It's my mirror that I got. Um, this was three eighty, and I love the pattern. I feel like it goes really well with this um, this pink. I think it does at least. Um, it just it looks really good with it. Nothing else to say about that. Okay. Next place I went is Sephora, and um. I have always, so the first, I'm just going to say, the first thing I use is the Urban Decay Chill Makeup Setting Spray. Um, so I have always used just the regular one, but I was like, why not try the other one? And, um, like, uh, I don't know, this one just has cooling in it, and sometimes, like, what if I'm hot? Like, this will be good. <laughs> um, and then I got, so I told my mom that if my my pimples right here, they're kind of worse in person, I guess, um, if they haven't covered up by the time school starts, that I'm going to get a expensive concealer, and I asked her for the money for one, so, yeah, this is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer, in the color Light One Chantilly, or Chantilly, Chantilly, I don't know, I love the packaging, though, I just think NARS's, like, logo is so classy, I don't know, I love it. Um, this is actually really, really light for me right now. Um, hopefully by the time I use it, though, it isn't. I'm going to be, like, using it kind of, like, in a highlighting way, though, so. And then I had, like, 175 points on my thing, so I picked, um, the Bare Minerals Ready Blush in the Natural High. I haven't used this yet, but I definitely think I'm going to go in by the full size, because this looks just like Orgasm, but in such cheaper form and it's like a peachy shimmer gold thing. Showing up very orange on camera, but what the heck? Who cares? Okay. So um the next the next thing that I got is the Naked Basics palette from um Urban Decay. Love this. I have nothing else to say about it. Um I think it's absolutely just great for a basic look. I got that at Ulta, by the way. Um, and then I got a new mascara, and this is the NYC Big Bold Mascara. And guys, like, my eyelashes are pretty great with this, and it was only four seventy nine. And then I got, um, these two new Eoses. They're the Visibly Soft. This one is Coconut Milk, and this one's Vanilla Mint, I think. I don't, I'm not sure. I like the pink one better, though. It just, it just, like, smells better overall. Um, and then you guys probably don't really care about this, but I got breast spray. Um, definitely. 
Um, and then I got uh deodorant. It's just some boring basics. Um, okay, moving on to bath. Uh, moving on to Bath and Body Works. Um, so I went to another store, and um, I really wanted this one, but they didn't have it, and I was really upset. And it's Cool Coconut Surf, and I had to get this because it's like coconutty, beachy, and it's just it's great because like it's gonna remind me of the summer and everything because seasonal depression is coming on, and I need this. Um, okay, so the next things that I got, I'm just gonna show you guys them all at once. Um, so, well, this is just the holder for them. This is like a, there's like little thingies on the bottom of it. I don't know. Um, so I got Meyer Lemon, Weekend Apple Picking, um, Graham Cracker Marshmallow, Brown Sugar Carrots, and Peach Pecan Cupcake. So those are all of the hand sanitizers that I got. Again, it was like a it was like a five for five deal. So I was like, why not? It was cheap, so I don't care. Um, okay, so I tried to film this video before, and I have a lot of stuff from Abercrombie. So if you guys are not into that stuff, then you should probably get that right now. But I'm just gonna start off with the pants. So the first thing that I got are these leggings that have like this like. Can you see? Yeah, you can see them. Um, they're just the high-rise leggings, and I love these just to go with a gray shirt and a nice um, necklace. I absolutely love these. They're just like such like a basic winter outfit, like printed leggings. And then I got these to go with like a light pink shirt. Um, they're just regular plain navy stripes. So yeah, I love those. And then I got these lounge pants, guys. These are extremely soft. You don't even know. Uh, by the way, I got everything in a size up, so stuff was a little bit too big for me, but that's okay. The flaties look huge. <laughs> Never buy a size up, guys. It's not a good idea. Okay, and then I have... Oh, no, these are not new. Same. Same. And then I have these pants, which are just like the last ones, except they're purple. And they're, um... They have, like that like sign on it. I don't know, it's the Department of Athletics. Obviously I don't run. I hate running. So yeah. Then I have just these um basic pair of green um leggings. Not leggings. Sorry guys. Leggings, not leggings. Jeans. They're high no, they're just jeggings. They're regular jeggings. Okay. Way too many words in my mouth right now guys. Then I got this shirt which <laughs> Didn't exactly realize it was a half shirt, but I'm going to be wearing a cardigan over it, so I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's a sh half shirt, though. Then the back has this, like, thing in it. So, yeah. Then I got this shirt that says, it's like a cropish type top. You're supposed to wear it with high rise. Jeans. And it says, collect moments, not thanks. I don't know, I just like how it goes, like, big font, small font, big font. I don't know. Just five dollars, whatever. Then I got um this shirt that says, these are like one of the tighter shirts, Messy Hair, Vogue, and Copy. That's me, you guys. Seriously. I'm rocking that messy hair all the time. Okay, and then I got this shirt. I found this shirt just so, oh my god, I cannot even describe how cute this shirt is. It's just like this like print and this girl taking a picture. I absolutely love it. It's so gorgeous. Um okay, so then like a next sh the next shirt that I got is this shirt and I really wanted a basic tee like this. Um just to go with like cardigans and stuff and put necklaces over just cuz it's like basic but it's like a nice dressy shirt. Uh okay, so this is the biggest thing that I purchased, guys. It's a snit, which is like a sweater, but it's knit. A shirt that's knit. I'm sorry, guys. I bought this in a size up. It was a mistake. I should have bought it in a size down. Um, it's huge, guys. I mean, I guess I like big sweaters, though. It's just uh, like a heather gray color. If you know what I mean? Um, and then I got this basic shirt to wear with those navy leggings. And it says, Fitch, New York, 1892. It's just like three-fourth sleeves. But, like... 
if you guys can't tell, these match well, so well together, those two colors. Then from TJ Maxx, I just found this, so it's random, I'm sorry. It's by the brand Phase One. So, it's this gorgeous shirt. I've been seeing this print all over Tumblr and everything. Um, it's this gorgeous printed shirt. Like, do you see that print, bro? Yes. Get it in a size up, um, because this, this, like, lacy print, this, like, lacy material kind of runs a little small, so that's what I did. And then, um, today from Abercrombie, I ordered all that stuff online, um, I got this shirt from, from Abercrombie. It's good to go with, like, nice necklaces on a basic winter day. Like, can you see how it's, like, you guys see how it's, like, see-through, kind of? Yeah. That's what it looks like. It has a pocket on it, and it's, like, really, really loose and good for, like, um, necklaces and stuff. Oh, yeah, by the way, my necklace is, my necklace is from Abercrombie. It's just this gorgeous, it's such a statement. Then, um, my white three-fourth shirt is from Abercrombie, and then my high-rise super skinny jeans that are a light pink color are from there, too. Um, and then I have two other necklaces, because I, like, want to try something new, for my style this winter, I want to get like some necklaces into my wardrobe because I never wear jewelry, and it's just this um like this nice like crumble pendant. No, it's not crumble. It's like a pendant, but it's like it's like a a bunch. I don't. I can't describe it. But it's, this necklace, like I said, is the, what I'm wearing is from Abercrombie also, and then I got this one. Oh my god, this is adorable. It's just like random things on it. I don't know. I just really like it. And then, um, the two things from these two sweaters that I got from Abercrombie, I'm gonna have to try them on for you because they just look like huge things of material when I don't try them on. Fail. Okay. This is so worth your money. Okay. This thing, if I could get it on. So worth your money, guys, because I paid like forty dollars for this. But I don't even care. Okay, so this is what it looks like. As you can tell, maybe I'm not sure. It's like um, I don't know. It has like this like this like crumbly thing on the sides, and yeah, I just really, really love it. Um, I think it's absolutely adorable. And then the next cardigan that I got is this, um, pink one, this, like, lighter, lighter pink one, I guess you can call it, I'm trying to figure out a way to tell you what it looks like, oh, there we go, this one's exactly like the other one, except it's, like, t-shirt material more, and it's, like, um, has a hood on it, but it looks like this, I just love how it drapes down like that, I think it looks so good, I don't know, I like it, I love it a lot. I like how it drapes down so much. I just think it's so cool. I know my jeans look white, but they're not white. Okay, guys. So, that is it for this haul. I guess it's big, kind of. Whatever you guys consider big. Um. So, yeah, I really enjoyed shopping for all these clothes. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.